So phase one, we, we did all interior work. We started from the event level of the building and worked our way up to the key bank level. Um, and we didn't do any exterior work. So when you stood outside last year before phase one, and at the end of phase one, you wouldn't have known we had done anything. As you can see behind me, that's not the case for phase two and three. So we started working outside the building on the plaza and we're working our way up. So phase two is the main concourse, the entry pavilion, and the Creek de Vault suite level. Whoever thought that 22 years ago, uh, this building would become a new generation building, uh, and it will as we go forward. Since uh, April, uh, they've been working on phase two. They came right in and started uh, in demolition. And as you can see behind me, uh, it's being demolished. Uh, as we did out on the uh, plaza area, when we took down the garage, uh, and we are digging out there because we're gonna have one of the greatest plazas uh, any place in this country, and the skating rink gonna be bigger than Rockefeller Plaza. So in addition to what we're doing from a construction perspective, we've really upgraded the guest experience overall. So we're trying to create a more frictionless experience. We have mobile tickets, we're cashless. I think it'll be a quicker in and out. We're adding grab and go markets that you'll be able to just tap your phone or your credit card, take what you want and walk out of the store. You'll be charged automatically. So we're really um, upgrading all of the amenities for our fans that you can imagine from the minute they arrive until the minute they leave. I was part of the team that built this building starting in 1997 when we opened it in 1999. I, I was wondering whether it could ever get better, but it's gotten better. There's no question about it. Mel Rains and her team of folks who are building this with Shield Sexton and Populous have just made a major difference in this building. And people ask me, what are you excited about for people to see? I say the whole thing. You know, when you come into the entry building, you're gonna be able to see outside the door. When you come into the bowl, you're gonna see new seats. You're gonna see the great scoreboard if you didn't see it last year. When you go out to buy concessions, you're gonna see new concession stands and windows and all kind of different things. And you're gonna see when you come right up the stairs in the entry building, you're gonna look right in the bowl. I'm excited about stuff like that. I think it's easier to say what we're not touching by the end of this project than what we are touching. So there isn't anything that the fans are gonna see when they come back that isn't gonna be new or on its way to being new. Whether that's the entry pavilion, their concessions, the restrooms, the seat that you're sitting in, the new bars that we're adding, it's all intended to make it for a better experience for the fans and we can't wait for them to see it.